Hey everybody, it's Brian House here for Housework, and tonight we are working on the uh, Harley Davidson Sportster engine. I am gearing up for the top end disassembly so that we can replace all the seals and the gaskets. And I noticed that the exhaust studs are really rusted and they are set in the heads. Now, every engine I've ever had to rebuild, the exhaust studs were always a problem. They were rusted in, they were hard to remove. Um, sometimes I had to drill them out and tap them, which is a huge pain in the ass. So tonight I'm actually trying a new technique that I read about online where you can pop a MIG weld right on the nut, the nut that holds the actual exhaust on, if it were there. And then that you use that to back off the exhaust stud. So I've never done this before, but I'm crossing my fingers that it's actually going to work. We'll see. But uh, I also think that the heat that is generated from the MIG welder would probably help too in this situation. So, all right, let's give it a shot. So this is the result of the exhaust bolt extraction from last night. Uh, I got all four out. I sure did. And, um, but I learned a lot in the process. Uh, the first three came out pretty easy. The last one sheared off inside. And, but left me about a half of an inch of stud sticking out to work with. So that was uh, beneficial. The mistake I made was I tried to extract the stud while it was still warm. Uh, you know, the heads are aluminum and the studs are steel. So when the studs warm up, they seat themselves into the aluminum and it's going to be tough to get them out. Uh, and I also didn't clean my metal enough. I should have grabbed a wire wheel and just cleaned them off. And then that way my welds would have been a little bit stronger. Um, had I done those two things, I probably wouldn't have sheared this off, but you know what? We got it out. That's cool. So the, the steps I took once it sheared off was I grabbed a little bit larger nut, slid it over the stud, didn't have to thread on or anything. And then I popped my welds on the outside, uh, to, to really seat that nut on there and then, um, cleaned it, popped more welds, cleaned it, popped more welds. And what that did was it gave me um, a really strong surface so that I could put a larger socket on there and back it out. Um, it, the, but the key was uh, to walk away after a few minutes after the weld had set. That way the metal had time to cool off to room temperature and we were able to, you know, extract the stud. So anyhow, thanks for watching. I do appreciate it. We'll continue on with the engine project and the Sportster rebuild. Uh, this is Brian House. For housework. Thanks for watching. Check us out on Instagram at house underscore underscore work. That's two underscores between those words. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that subscribe button and leave us a like.